everybody. This is Budget with Mama Bear. I am back for another video. Um, I just wanted to go through my system on what I have going right now. Um, I will probably be changing things up when it comes to the new year, but I kind of wanted to give you an idea of what you see um, in my setup here. So I'm going to go through my binders real quick just to kind of give you an idea of how I set up my financial um, journey and then I'm going to be unstuffing um, some of the cash envelopes that I have because I've spent some money so that I need to reimburse myself. All right, so let's get started. So my first binder is my yearly binder and with this I have my car registration, my HOA, we pay yearly on this, not um, quarterly or monthly. Uh, lacrosse, so my son, um, we save up for a yearly fee that I have to pay. Um, prime, I always want to save for that. And wood, we do go out and get our own wood, which we have to pay for tags as well as we buy some because it's getting harder every year as we get older. So I have to save yearly on that. We just um, spent a lot out of here to get us ready for the winter. So I'm what I'm adding in in the future is going to be um, for next year. Okay, so that is my yearly. My next binder is my quarterly binder. <clears throat> And on that, I have car maintenance, medical, propane. We are on propane, so I do pay that um, when they come and fill up our tank. And then I also have on here um, my business envelopes that I'm saving for to hopefully get an Etsy shop started. Um, but that's in the future, so I'm saving up for that right now just to get supplies. Okay, my next nice and shiny, I love this color, is my events binder. And I quickly put um, this new um, sheet that I got from Breezy Budget Shop in here. I thought it matched really well. Okay, so I have birthdays, Christmas, holidays, and trips. We go on a lot of trips. Um, the short, little, inexpensive trips, but I have to budget for those. And it's been really hard because we've had to put plane flights on credit cards, and I really want to get away from that. So I am going to start filling this in for the year so I don't have to do that on my credit card anymore. Okay. My next binder is my sinking funds. Now, Based on our family's budget, I do have quite a bit of sinking funds, as you will see. <clears throat> All right, so I have Amazon, Beauty, Clothing, Costco, Crafts. I am a huge crafter, so I do budget for that. Household, Pets. We have four fur babies. Yard, um, we have... Expenses for our yard that are yearly to help maintain it. We have a pretty big yard, so I do have to budget for that. Okay, and then the next binder is my high priority um, savings binder. Okay, so I have this cute little cover. Um, extra debt. So when I have some extra money, I will put it in here and I'll put it towards my de debt monthly, wherever it's, that's going to be lately. It's been credit cards. Um, I'm saving for a month ahead. Um, extra loan, truck loan. We have a truck loan. So extra payments on that are going to go in here. Um, I am saving for a cruise that I want to take in 2024 and I want to pay all cash. So this is a high priority because it's something we really want to do. I'm sorry, I have it upside down. It's something we really want to do, and we've it's been our dream. So <laughs> we are saving for that. So this is for the actual cruise, any excursions, and spending money for that trip. 
So for us in our family, that is a high priority. Okay, and then I have our not so high priority savings challenges. So one thing that I do is bear bucks. So any um, dollar here, I'll show you in here, that has a B on it. Um, I will save in here and then once I fill up my card here, I will deposit that and put it towards, probably right now it's going to be towards extra paying off debt or the truck loan, but it's just something fun to save for. Um, this is a savings tracker that I got from Jordan Budgets. It's to save $1,000 and with that I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with it yet, but I have some ideas. Last minute vacation. In the new year, I'm probably gonna consolidate that with my trips. Um, shop small business fund. This is something I wanna definitely um, put money into. I really like supporting other people's Etsy shops that are in the budgeting community, and um, I love it. So um, I wanna save up for that so I can um, spend money on other people's shops. And then weight loss challenge, um, for every pound, I put $10 in here. I'm just starting this. We'll see how we do. We've got the holidays coming up and yeah. And then this is one I'm going to start. Um, I'd like to get my road to a hundred subscribers on my YouTube. Um, I really want to just get a jump start. try to see if anybody will follow me. So please go ahead and subscribe down below. Um, if you haven't already and hit the notification bell, uh, that way you will get notified when I put new videos up. Hey, I'm just starting out. So I do appreciate your support on this. All right. Now this binder is going to be for the new year and I haven't set it up yet, but this is going to be where I'm going to keep all my savings challenges. Okay. And over here I have, this is new. I'm going to use this. I just got this in the mail from breezy budget budget shops and it is for december i made this little tracker to go with it each day i'm going to save money so that way i have some money in january so that is going to go in here um this is my hundred envelope challenge box i did make these and i did make this little tracker um and i'm about a third of the way there. I didn't start it very, I just started it like in the last month or so. So there's not much in there right now. Okay, so that's what we have for now. Okay, now I'm going to get my list here and I'm going to pull out some funds. Like I said, I've been shopping or going and spending some of this. So, and I have some bills to pay out of here that I need to pull out. So on my yearly, I need to pull out car registration, $105. We got the bill for my husband's truck. Okay, so $105. Um, where we live, it's a fee, not a tax, so it's actually pretty reasonable. Um, all right, and I think, yes, that's it. Okay, in quarterly, I'm gonna pull, let's see, medical, I need $10. Had to go to the doctor the other day, so I had a copay. And let's see what else is in here. Uh, I think that's it, okay. Sinking funds is the next thing. I'm gonna pull out um, Costco. We went to Costco. I spent all my money, um, I took my husband with me and that's what happened. So I have 50, 70, 90, 100, and five, six, seven, eight, 108 dollars I'm pulling out, but towards my credit card. Um, household, I'm gonna pull 45. I had to use some of this for some of the expenses at Costco. So I have 45. And that's it. Okay, um, events, I am gonna pull all my Christmas money out. I have $500 in the bank already. So this is the cash that I have left over. Um, so I'm gonna pull 100, 200, 350 because that needs to 
go in my account because I'm going to do a lot of Christmas shopping in the next week. And then holidays, I'm actually going to pull a little extra out of here. I've got 25 I'm going to pull out. That leaves me with 25 left over. Sorry, this is getting a little messy here. Okay, so I think that's everything. Let's go ahead and count up how much we have here. It's got a little out of organized here. So let's see. And ones. Alrighty, let's get this organized. So how are you guys doing? Have you started your Christmas shopping yet? Um, I have just started, but I tend to buy a lot of things online just because where we live, it's just easier um, to do that. So I pay my credit card off of the cash. But what's nice about saving the cash is I know exactly how much I have to spend. And if I don't do this and I use just my credit card just randomly, I will just go overboard and that's not good with our the way that we want to um, work with credit cards right now. So we really want to um, live on a cash budget lifestyle. So let's see how much we have. We have 100, 200, 300, 50, oh sorry, 350, let's just do this, 50, 1, 52, another 200, so that's 500, 2, 4, 6, 8, 100, so we're up to 600, 10, 20, 620, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, and 3. So that is a total of $643 that I'm going to be taking to the bank. And we will get that in and pay towards our credit cards. So thanks again for stopping by. I will be posting hopefully a couple more videos Um by the end of the week, I really want to get a head, good head start on um, showing you my budgeting and how I'm doing things here to get a good start on my channel. Thank you again for stopping by. Please subscribe. Um, I really appreciate your support in getting me started here. Have a blessed day.